Uh, ladies and gentlemen, welcome to the Rajas Kaka Sungura YouTube channel. Kaka, Jafet Kome, the IG of police, is a man under siege. And this man is going to face the consequences of mistreating Raila Odinga during the Mandamano. Javed Kome, I feel in my heart, is a man who is going to be thrown out of the Kenya Kwanza government. I see it coming. Na yona inakuja. Na wakati wa maandamano wale muna nifuata, na kumbuka sana nikimuonya kome, nikamambia Jafet, listen, hawezi ukajua kesho itakuwaje katika siyasa za Kenya. Usikubali kutumiwa sana kuumiza watu wazimio. Kesho, you never know how politics will unfold. He couldn't listen to me because I was just a mere boy from Kisi. Now, in the few years I've been in this country, there's something I've learned. You cannot humiliate Raila and go unpunished. It's not Raila who punishes you. It's the gods. You can't humiliate Raila and go unpunished. Let me give you an example. See what is happening to Gashawa now. Gashawa humiliated Raila is paying for the cost. Even their cabinet secretaries who humiliated Raila, they are going to pay the cost. Where we go to the report petition to the Nadiko government instead of the Kenya Kwanza government. Nini go jeni? Subiri. They are going to be cabinet secretaries when you are because. Once Raila and Ruto forms a Nadiko government, that's it. I end up Kenya Kwanza government. That's it. End up the Nadiko government. <laughs> in 2017, it was a handshake government. That's it. In end up with what the Nadiko government. The Nadiko government will give Raila an opportunity to front a list of cabinet secretaries he wants Ruto to appoint. Mount Kenya walipewa more than 10 slots. Gasha wataenda kumia. Kuna watu watakuwa fired. One of them is Moses Kuri and the rest. Watch this space. Kinaisha juma. Wataona tabu. Taona tabu. Anyway. That aside. Turudi kwa Jafet Kome. Jafet Kome. The National Police Service Commission is instructing parliament to initiate a process of kicking Kome out of his job. Why? is an incompetent individual. Wow, wanajua sahi. Mimi nilijua hii last year. Na nikawambia, huyu Javed Kome is an incompetent officer. Haya nilisema nikachoka. Thank God you are agreeing with me now. Now, the National Police Service Commission is recommending to the National Assembly and asking members of parliament to initiate a process of kicking out Jafet Kome. Remember, Jafet Kome is one of the people who was used to, 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 to badly attack Azimio and sadly to personally attack Raila Odinga during the mandaman. Uyu ndia jamaa alisema atiraila anaenda kwa mochari, anahaya bodies, analeta kupika picha kwa street. You remember that statement? Mungu harari Jafet. Listen to what the commission is saying. When it appeared before the National Assembly's Committee on Implementation and Oversight Committee, the chairman of the commission, Eliud Kenodia detailed instances where the police boss 
allegedly undermined the operations of the police employer. Kinudia accused Kome of, amongst other arbitrary recruitment, promotion of police officers, roles that they say should be carried out by the commission itself, constitutionally. The commission further accused the IG of allegedly recruiting and employing police reservists bypassing NPSC. Ladies and gentlemen, Mimi, I was given a vision last year that Hataka Maruto Amemtewa Jafet Kome, Jafet failed to understand that in politics, tables turn. The IG failed to understand that in politics, things change. The IG failed to know that one time Raila will eat together with William Ruto. Jafet lacked an understanding of knowing that one day we shall have a Nadiko government instead of Kenya Kwanzaa. Now, all the sins that the police committed during the demonstrations, one man is going to bear the cross. Nyinyi muliona Raila akichukua picha Raila akiajiri press ya kufile how uh, the police brutally were assaulting protesters mukafikiria Raila is doing it for sure of ngoja wacha kwanza serikali ya nadi ko itengenezwe ndugu zanguni mutatambua mutajua Raila ni nani katika Kenya hii Mwasifikiria yule mzee ni mujinga <laughs> Nyinyi ngoja Wacha serikali ya nadi ko itengenezwe. Raila wameungana na Ruto. Wacha wakai chi. You know, sasa, bado serikali haijaundua. Sasa ndiyo serikali naenda kutengenezwa. Right? Ladies and gentlemen, we are yet to form a... Iye nye imekuwako, ni ile neto kushikiria tu. Ile ya kuanzisha. Ile ya, ku, ya, ya kupiga foundation. But let me tell you, after the Nadiko bill is over from parliament, sasa ndiyo serikali kamili inaenda kuundua. And let me tell you, one of the people wenye wataumia ni Jafet Kome. Ngo Jenny. Ruto ataanza kunenepa sasa. Kwa nini? Ndiyo serekari naenda kutengenezwa sasa. <laughs> Nadiko government. Kalonzo wako pale kama official opposition leaders. Laila yuko pale kama chairman wa AU. Ivatoli Gulguini. Eh, serekari naenda kuundua. Makabine tuwa wa secretary wa Raila wamewekwa pale. Muliona Ruto ameappoint watu wa Raila. Including Raila Odinga sister. By the way, Ruto appointed Raila Odinga sister. Mwenye anaitua, let me, let me check this name. Anaitua al, Walko, eh, Walko, wal, Walkowa. Miss hmm? Akinyo Walkowa. She was appointed deputy heads of missions, Los Angeles, USA. Sasa, ndugu zanguni, serekari ndo inaanza kundwa. And by the time this government itatengenezwa, Nadiko government, oh, <laughs> kinagashawa hawata onekana, kinagashawa wataenda nyumbani, kinagashawa watakufa stress, kinagashawa, I don't know where they will be. But ladies and gentlemen, let me tell you, politicians are relatives. They fight one another during the day, but they fight each other at night. God bless you, ladies and gentlemen. See you in the next video. Asante Nisan.